Let's get to work. Whatever's locked in that ghost head is the only thing that's gonna save all of us. You! Who are you? Maybe this will remind you. Leo, no! <laughs> What do you mean, no? I just saved your butt. Did you? Sorry, I took you out. Twice. Yeah, well, at least you didn't use your brown at full strength. Yeah, that's right. I always dial it back for the ladies. <laughs> we think we found a way to stimulate your memories by acting out some scenes from your past with Crate. Hoping that when he gave you the Doomsday virus, he told you how to deactivate. So, we're gonna reenact that moment. I'm gonna play Crane, and Chase will play you. Hold on. How come you get to play Crane? Because I knew one better than anybody. Plus, I do a spot on impression. I used to kill at our dinner parties. <laughs> and then he threatened to kill me. Well, I'm definitely not gonna play S1. No offense. Why not? Too much of a stretch for you to reach that level of macho? <laughs> no offense. Guys, we don't have time to argue. But just for the record, I do think you would make a great S1. You want to borrow green boots? We can stuff some paper on there so they fit. Can we just do this? You're on an operating table in Crane's lab. It's dark. You're terrified. The madman approaches. Now, please don't give me yes. I don't suppose this is helping you remember anything. No, but it is making me hope that when I do blow up, I take these two out with me. <laughs> no offense. So, does this mean we can finally put our past behind us? I guess. But just in case you decide to get all evil again, I'm rocking a bionic leg now. Plenty of other horrifying memories to replace them with.